Hi there, Traditional Chimney Sweep here. If you're looking for a lucky sweep for your wedding, then look no further. In this video, I'm gonna show you what you can expect, how to make a booking, and everything you need to know about lucky chimney sweeps on your big day. With our opening correspondence, we'll determine the time of arrival. I'll make sure I set off in good time to get there without any delay. While approaching the location, I'll be mindful of where we are and park a short distance away so as not to be seen. Before putting my hat and brush on to avoid detection, I'll take a quick scout of the area to find the location and where the bride and groom will be exiting the church. Any specific details can be requested. I found a nice pub opposite the church to view the exit. This means I can stay out of sight until the exact moment I'm needed. So as the bride and groom leave the church, I can get myself into position for when I'm wanted. So whether by signal or by timing requirement, I can be outside to meet the bride and groom as they leave the church. I'll also stick around to greet the guests. Now the question everyone asks is why a chimney sweep at a wedding? And while it isn't specifically documented of the origins of this tradition, in folklore and cultural traditions, it's been well ingrained primarily in England as early as the 18th century. Chimney sweeps, primarily young apprentices who swept the chimneys, became associated with various symbolic meanings. And in the context of weddings, they were seen as harbingers of good luck, wealth and prosperity. While the tradition of having a chimney sweep at a wedding gained prominence primarily in England, the popularity spread to countries and regions over time. Each different cultural context has adapted this tradition based on its own customs and beliefs of that area. And as a result, there's a variation of different rituals and symbolisms associated with chimney sweeps at weddings. But the one particular story that shared throughout England and among many different chimney sweeps takes us back to 1730, when a horse and carriage carrying the princess was traveling down the street. For some unknown reason, the horse got spooked and decided to bolt. All the people ran to avoid this horse, except one brave chimney sweep, armed only with his brush and rod. When the chimney sweep managed to calm the horse down, only to find the princess and King George II as the rider of the horse. The next day, King George II decided to track down the local hero, asking the people who it was, and it was revealed to be the local chimney sweep. The king decided to invite the chimney sweep to his daughter's wedding. It was here that the king declared by royal decree that chimney sweeps everywhere were the bearers of good luck and given the greatest respect. So if you'd like to make a booking to have a lucky chimney sweep at your wedding, you can email me at bookings at traditionalchimneysweep.com or if you prefer, you can go to the website and get the contact phone number, drop me a text message and I'll be happy to discuss it. 